Well, science is taking over the Del Mar Fairgrounds today for the High Tech Fair. San Diego 6's Amanda Shotsky is live at the event that exposes local students to the world of science and the possibilities of a career in science. Let's get out to Amanda. Yeah, this is a very cool event. And guys, I don't know why, but I seem to need a hat in every single of my live shots. So I found one that's very fitting for the occasion here. And let me ask you, what the heck is this? What the heck is this? Well, thousands of students are going to find out if they come out to the high tech fair here at the Del Mar Fairgrounds. You can see that all of the vendors have already started setting up, and I'm going to walk you down this way because we actually have some students that have graciously gotten up very early this morning to come check out these really cool vendors and some of these very awesome experiments that they're going to see. Now, there's about 60 vendors out here, and it's all about getting a hands-on experience with science and technology. You see we have UC San Diego that has set up a booth here. I'm going to interrupt Alex back here, who is the scientist on hand. What are you guys working on here? Hey, so I'm Alex, and I manage the geological collections at Scripps uh, Institution of Oceanography. And so we're basically here with um, UC, with Robbie here at the UC's STEAM channel. Um, and so we're promoting not only technology, engineering, and math, but also the arts. So getting really creative about how we do our science. Um, so Let's talk about what you have on the table here, because to be honest, I didn't recognize anything except for these Reese's Pieces right over here. So, <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is everything else? Awesome. So we're basically a repository of uh, sediment cores and rocks and microfossils from the bottom of the ocean. And so we actually act like a, a lending library, but we don't expect to get our samples back. And so people request samples from all of our ocean bottoms. Um, we also have a growing coral collection. Um, we have things here like glassy basalt from the East Pacific Rise. Um, we also have things that come from our hydrothermal vents. Um, this is an example of an unsplit, tiny little sediment core, but we actually work, work with the ocean drilling program to get deeper records, so going back in time, 100 million year long records, reconstructing past climates, things of that nature. All right, very cool. Sounds amazing. So thousands of students are going to get to check this out. Thank you so much for uh, speaking with us, Alex. Where is Kelly? We have Kelly over here, a student I've been chatting with, and you're over here checking out the, uh, the remote control cars over here. Tell me a little bit about what you're learning today. Um, today I learned a lot of stuff. Um, are you talking about the robot? Yeah. Okay. Um, we actually program and do coding for the program mm -hmm. and to control the, th the robot, but we actually don't control the robot. We program it to move, but we don't. nobody moves it. It just moves by itself by okay. the program wins. I'm going to have to see this in action. That's pretty cool. Let's check it out. How does this work? Can, can someone put this in action? Oh, we're going to see how this moves. So, no one's controlling this, correct? No, it's, no one's controlling it. It's moving by itself. How it pro we program it, it moves. That is so cool. Look at that. There you go. It programs by its, it moves all by itself. So, this is just one of the things that students will get to check out. Uh, the High Tech Fair. It is going on today. It starts off at 8 o'clock this morning. And... Thousands of students from across the county are going to get to take a really cool field trip here today, and it ends at 2 o'clock. We're going to have more interactive, really cool demos to show you as the hour continues. I'm going to send it back to you guys. I think you're going to have to get a bigger hairnet. You've got a lot of hair, girl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it just doesn't contain it, does it? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> All right.